Before this video starts, I want to quickly ask you guys to turn on the notifications on the little bell icon so you will be the first one to see my videos. For me, this is way too much. So as you can see, if we bring up the size, it is going to just make it bigger and bigger until it's even like almost covered the entire screen. But we're gonna start with zero and this is the first uh, option that we have because I think in some kind of ways, um, there's only gonna be a stroke that's gonna be really thick. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go and we're gonna make this uh, a smart object just convert to smart object. What's happening guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new Photoshop tutorial and in this video guys, I'm gonna show you guys how to add an outline to an image in Photoshop. So as you guys clearly can see, this is an image of myself and probably you guys all can notice that there's only uh, just uh, a shadow behind the image. There's no outline at all. So what I'm going to do now in this video is I'm going to show you guys how to add this outline to whatever image you have. It's going to be really simple. So I would say uh, let's get started. So as you can see right now, this is an image of mine that I use for thumbnails as well. And I'm going to just show you guys how to add an outline. At the right at the bottom, we have all the layers. So this is the first one and this is me uh, the act of the actual this is the actual image so what we're gonna do is we're gonna right click onto that image and we are going to go to a blending options now we're gonna see this entire box with how you can add a outer glow a drop shadow a bit a shadow but if you can see if I add in the outer glow and if I make it black it is not something that I need right now because I don't know like as you guys can see this is a big shadow but that's not what we want we want a nice uh, even outline so we're not going to go to outer glow or shadow or, or, or anything that we see but we're going to go to stroke right here we're going to check this and as you can see already there is a stroke appearing now we're going to click on the stroke and right now we can also choose the color so we're going to go and change this to i would say let's change it to black because you would not see it on white as you can see so we're going to make it black and i'm going to click on ok but right now the size is 12 that's way too much well it depends on what kind of things you like the for me, this is way too much. So as you can see, if we bring up the size, it is going to just make it bigger and bigger until it's even like almost covered the entire screen. But we're gonna start with zero and this is the first uh, option that we have because I think in some kind of ways, um, there's only gonna be a stroke that's gonna be really thick. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go and we're gonna make this a, a smart object, just convert to smart object. And I hope it's going to work right now. As you can see, if I, if I pick the stroke, it's still going to be just uh, really thick. But that's not gonna happen to you. Uh, I'm just, I'm pretty sure, I'm 99% sure that that won't happen to you. So as you can see right now, this is how you add a stroke. There are other methods um, to add a stroke, but the thing that I just want to not like recommend at all is just going with uh, the paint brush and just go around the image and make an outline like that. It's gonna be really sloppy. It's not gonna be uh, a very steady stroke at all. Just go, just right click on the layer right here. Just pick blending options go to stroke check it and right now you can also choose to do it on the inside that's going to be that's going to be really weird but the, out, the outline is going to be uh, very thin but this is going to add it on the inside or you can do, just just do center and that is basically both i think it is so as you can see that is how you add a stroke guys it is really simple you can change it to any color you like it depends on what kind of project you're working on i'm just going to make it black and i'm just going to you know pick it to outside and this is how you do it guys this is how you add a stroke to your image it's really simple i know but that's how to do it so that is it for this tutorial i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to smash the like button down below for more tutorials for more photoshop tutorials actually photoshop cc the latest version 2017 every tuesday at 2 p.m pst on my channel so thank you for the continued support guys we're going towards 110,000 subscribers um I'm so freaking thankful for this, guys. So thank you for watching, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Just Alex Halford.